A lone man from the future, sent back in time to stop video games, before they take over the world. By beating them with his super awesome time traveling future ship. Now from his super secret underground base beneath New York City, prepare to watch as he fights using his impressive gaming skills, to save the world.
Gaming. Hey, what's up, dude? Yo. Welcome. Yo, 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 yo. Welcome. To the broadcast. Yo, this uh, dude, a future man, coming to you live from New York City, baby. Welcome one, welcome all to the Future Man Gaming Broadcast. The Salmon King is about to fly high into the sky. Because that's what the Salmon King can do when he needs to save the princess. He's got to save Zelda, the princess. Save Zelda. Save the future. What's up, everybody? Welcome to the stream. Who is in the chat right now? I'm seeing some nice moves. I'm seeing some hype. I'm seeing some uh, FMG bros in the chat. We got Bloop D Bloop. We got 8 Bit Dojo. Havoc in the house. Gibbed, what's up, guys? The Vector's here for that booty. Those buns, baby. Nice buns. Captain Kirkland, hello, welcome. Nom Bread, good to see you. Jake the Snake, Alex, hello, Alex. Nube. What's up, Nube? Wow. Whoa! Oh, Cat Daddy Neff. 11 months in a row. For the buns. Nice moves, nice buns. Almost one year, Cat Daddy. Love your style. <laughs> Hope everything's going fantastic. There's John! Wow. John! What's up, John? How you doing, my dude? Good to see you, John Carnage! Can't wait to see you, my man. Very soon. Very wow. soon, hang time is gonna be real. We got Cortari 16 months in a row for the future, for the buns. We got Scuba Steve with the 25 spot. Maximum buns activated. Thank you, Scuba Steve, for the long-term support, 27 months, and upgrading it to that 25 sub. Thank you, Scuba Steve. Scuba Steve, damn you! Damn you, damn you, damn you. Like, I have, I will never stop. <laughs> Every time Scuba Steve pops in the chat, I have to do the, the Big Daddy reference. I'm Scuba Sam, Scuba Steve's father. Scuba Steve, damn you. Thank you, Scuba. Steve, and Cortari, and Cat Daddy, and Brandon Blah for one year before the stream even freaking started. Tried to sneak in there. No, 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 no. I was sitting here, doing this, a little bit. Doing this a little bit. Sometimes I chat in the chat. I like to see who's first. First! First! Because there's nothing more impressive. Guys, let me tell you something. You've seen it in the YouTube comments. You've seen it over the years. If you're first in the chat, there's nothing more attractive to the ladies. I know that those guys just kill it. <laughs> we don't stand a chance. Let's go. We're... You gotta be first in the comments section, okay? <laughs> on your Tinder profile, I always comment first on my on the newest videos that come out on YouTube. The ladies will be unable to resist you. <laughs> John, John is 69. That is uh that is not first, John. But that number also could be useful in some way I, I let me know John let me know how that goes being 69 oh, oh, yeah. oh yeah, 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 yeah oh baby what is up Gandalf hey I'm a prime L dirty squirrel nutty nutty nuts Chrissy Mo what's up Chrissy Scooby like zoinks dude like whoa man come on dude that's that's kind of shaggy right whoa uh, come on now. That's a little bit. Okay, it's getting worse. The more I'm doing it, the impression's getting worse. I just need to say, like, zoinks, and that's all I need to do. Like, zoinks, man. Like, whoa. Isn't that what, isn't that? Row, row, hoo, row, row, hoo. He's like, 
Yeah, I don't know, man. I haven't watched Scooby in such a long time. I'm a little bit rusty on that one. You know what I'm not rusty on? Ah, yeah, yeah. Wah! I'm a Wario. I'm a gonna win. <laughs> we get that one enough. We get that one. We get that one enough for sure. Chris, how are the nice buns tonight? The buns are feeling good. The buns are feeling good. They were sitting in this chair for about 11 hours last night. About 11 hours last night. I was sitting on these buns playing some video games. Legend of Zelda. I will recap you once we load up the game. We made so much progress. And we still have some major things that we need to do tonight. We've got a list of things to do. We've got a to-do list for the Salmon King. Not as high pitched on the Scooby. Like Zoinks, man. Whoa, Scoob. Whoa, man. Are you gonna do a sub only stream? Danny, I don't think I need to do a sub only stream. I don't think we've ever done sub only mug. We haven't really had the need to. Um. Whoa. Captain Kirk, blinking guy. FMG buns, blinking guy. Wah moves. Blinking guy. Uh, the game plan is this. Play The Legend of Zelda tonight. I'll update you on our list of things to do once we open up the game. Then, tomorrow, more Legend of Zelda. Maybe even finishing the game. We gotta put in some work. Now, here's the reason why. Wednesday, I'm flying to Los Angeles. I'm gonna be in Los Angeles on Wednesday, on Thursday, on Friday, then I have a flight back here on Saturday. I will be doing some IRL streams from my phone in Los Angeles, but I would love to finish off The Legend of Zelda before going on that trip. It might not happen, but we're looking into it. I mean, we did a nice 11 hour stream last night. I'm feeling like we could settle into a nice one tonight and maybe finish it off tomorrow night. With that said, if we finish it off, that means on Saturday, we will be able to start either Prey, which I hear is like a sci-fi Bioshock. Sign me up for that shit. Or we'll be able to do some jukebox jams drinking some nice brews, and playing some Mario Kart. The best, most worst, terrible, awesome, fun, shitty, fun-ass game. Wario Kart! Ah! Frustrating, but fun. Frustrating, but fun. So that's what's going on. That's the game plan. That's the schedule. That's the schedule. Thinking guy. Blinking guy. Thinking, blinking guy. How's that sound to you guys? Does that sound good? In the meantime, we are also working on getting the ants exterminated. I'm also trying to keep my apartment from flooding. I'm very worried to leave the apartment for this long because something is going to break and something will go wrong. Something will freaking go wrong in this apartment. This is an insane apartment to live in because I could come back and... It could just be on fire. And I'd just be like, oh, it's fine. It's fine. Just take a sip from my tea. This is fine. Chris Q in the house. What's up, Chris Q? Gib. Yo, what's up, Gib? Cause E, what up? Dude, you gotta get Scuba, get a Switch. Get Mario Kart. You gotta get some games going. It's so much fun. It's so much fun. Yeah, I see you over there, Deli Lord. What's up, Deli? Hey there, Deli. Schreiser Drek. Yo, the pronunciation in the stream is the shit. Thanks, dude. Flooding in the apartment, sad face. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. This is my life now. Hey, what's up, toy makers? Welcome in here, toy makers. Hope you guys are doing good. Hope you guys are feeling good. Last night, we streamed all night. I slept for about four hours. Woke up, had some important super secret meetings for about four hours, four and a half hours. Then I was like, man, I need a nap. I'm exhausted. And then slept until like an hour ago. Woke up, ate some food, and then here we are back again. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, baby. Uh, no witness. There's some booties over there. Nice booties. Nice booties. Yeah, so that's the game plan 
Uh, new emotes still being worked on. We got a couple more emote slots that we can fill. Glad you guys are enjoying FMG Fine. Glad you guys are enjoying FMG Moves, the updated version. And of course, FMG Buns. buns, 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 buns. Nice moves, nice buns. Nice moves, nice buns. Um, let's play some Legend of Zelda. Let's play some video games. Let's play some video games. Video. Push the power button. Power. We need power. Do it. Give me power. We're listening to right now, if you don't know, Cinnamon Chasers. They play some cool tracks. Uh, some of you guys were talking before the stream started about having some sort of nice grooves emote or some more music centric emotes. I feel like we've got FMG dance. I mean, nice moves kind of goes hand in hand. We've got the better Twitch TV emotes, but I'm, I was trying to, I was like, hmm, think, 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 think. I was like, think, 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 think. What could be, I mean, we could just do a straight up nice grooves in the, in the same as moves, but then the word would be so small, it probably wouldn't even fit in there. We could just have something say grooves, and then you guys could type in nice moves, and then the next emote would be grooves. That's a possibility. Emotes. We've got a couple ideas. Pearly's here's here's a, here's the process of emotes. Pearly, uh, Pearly, goddamn thing, freaking thing. I usually throw out some ideas. The mods throw out some different ideas. Pearly goes into his little workshop and he, you know, figures out whatever he does, draws it, and then he comes back and then I give him feedback. Either sometimes he just nails it. Sometimes it's just like Pearly. <laughs> My God, it's incredible. Uh, like, think was a one one hit. Think was a one hit. I was like, Pearly nailed it. Uh, buns, I, buns might have been a one hit too. Pearly, did you, did, you, did you knock? Did you knock buns out of the park? Did you nail those buns? <laughs> did you nail those buns? You know what? Maybe we should get a saxophone emote. I need to play more. Whoa, wrong button. Where are we? Where are we? There we are, and we're back. And we're back. The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. The Legend of Zelda. Future Man, what, what helmet is that? Of the Wild. <laughs> buns was a second hit. That's right. He had to come back in. That's right. There was a bent over Buns emote. There's a bent over. And then uh, we decided, I was like, hmm, thinking, I was like, let's just stand that bun. Let's stand, let's stand that, that, that emote right on up there. Let's stand that emote. What's up, Starbarf? How you doing, man? Let's go ahead and just take that emote and just stand it right up. <laughs> wow. Ah, Nicole, yo, 10 months. Thank you, Nicole. Nice moves. For the future. For the future. Oh, man. On the last episode of Future Man Plays The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, we were doing a lot of things. Let me fill you in. Let's get to the map. We started off in Akala. We traveled all around Akala searching for things. We found this really cool place called the... Where is it? Where is it? Come on. Where is it? Spring of Power. The Spring of Power was very cool. It was very cool. And then we walked all the way up here. We walked all the way over here. It didn't let us take our horse here. So we spent a lot of time just on foot. Just doing that exploration thing. Exploring, exploring, exploring. We went down here into this like weird shrouded area. That was a really cool section of the game, of the stream last night. Then we could have ran over here, but we decided, listen, let's get our horse. So we transferred over to, I think it was this stable, and then made our way up here into the Snow World Tundra land of the north. We did not find a lot of shrines. Well, we found a couple of shrines up here, but we made our way over here. Then we came down here. This was like pretty barren and kind of pissed me off a little bit. We did get to snowboard, which was super fun. We were listening to a lot of Tony Hawk's Pro Skater soundtrack, of course. Then we went all the way down 
to then oh yeah then we put some Korok seeds in and then we and then and then and then we went to Hateno Village and we uh, cashed in some spirit orbs so as you can see look at this look at our stamina bar that perfect it, I was just gonna do one but it wasn't the perfect circle the perfect secondary circle so we did one heart and two stamina bars and then and then we did snow bowling I got a zero I got a gutter ball havoc and then I got a 10 and then I did it one more time and got a perfect strike and then we were out of there Nailed it. The snowboarding was extremely fun. I definitely was enjoying that. Um, and then we came down here, and there was a dragon down here. And we tried to land on it, but it was made of electricity. And that zapped us, and that kind of sucked. And uh, then we got this memory over here, and then we got another memory over here. And then we walked down here, and uh, we first try just destroyed the enemies in here. Mm, fake news. Uh, we got our ass kicked in here, and we decided it's not worth it. It's just one of those... What are those enemies called? It starts with an L. Lame losers. Lame losers. The, those giant horse things. And uh, now, now what do we need to do? Here's the things we need to do. Today's, okay, so that's the recap. That's the recap. Lionels, that's what they're called. Lionel. You know? Now Lionel from the first game. So now we need to explore this area. First thing we're going to do is we're going to go down here. I think there's a horse down here. A horse that we need to catch. What's up, Keegan? Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna, there's this like mystical, amazing horse that we're gonna go down here. We're gonna catch the horse. Then we're gonna explore this area. Explore. And I know there's a divine beast in here. Once we defeat that divine beast, then we finish off the last of the memories. Wrong button. We've got how many more? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six more memories to find. I have a decent idea where this one is. I kind of have an idea where this one is because the bird in the background. Uh, this one, I think, is an area we haven't really explored yet because you can see those uh, red, kind of, the red mountainous area in the background. And then this one, not really sure. In a forest. I think in a forest somewhere. So that's the game plan. Guys, any questions? Okay, let's do it, baby. Let's freaking do it. Let's go catch that horse. I hate to start off with fast traveling, but I think we're going to have to fast travel here. Destroy again, and we'll turn that off for now. So we're not doing that. We'll go right here. And we're going to catch that horse. We're going to catch the horse. Keegan, dropping the FMG, bro. What's up, Keeg? Yo. Yo, what's up? Hmm, 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 hmm. You have a question. Where do babies come from? Storks. Next question. <laughs> Obviously. Haven't you watched cartoons? <laughs> Haven't you watched cartoons? The rubber helm got it from doing the thunder magnet side quest. I just saw that, Captain Kirkland. What was the thunder magnet side quest? Give me some more information. You have a question. What helmet is that? It's the Salmon King helmet. <laughs> It's called the the Saba, yeah, the Saba Ping helmet. Salmon King, the Sa the Saba Ping. Okay, where's the horse? Horse is right down here. Apparently, the horse is right down there. That's where the horse is over there, guys. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go again on my own. Going down. I wonder if I could I not go into that cold area before? And, uh, I'm trying to think. I wonder if I said that I would come back to that later. Do any of you guys remember? I actually never played Yoshi's Island. Feels bad, man. Pearly says, where you find the axe on top of the stable causing lightning strikes. Wait, wait, wait. What are you talking about, Pearly? What are you talking about? Yo! P! P! P says, testing something. Don't mind me. Free money. Enjoy. Thank you, P. That looks like a legendary horse right there. Let, can you let us know if the test was at least successful, P? Can you at least give us something, P? Hold on. Oh. Okay. 
was it a success? Chords or I hate chords. Do -do -do. Fixed. Saved. Saved. <clears throat> Let's see. Vexus in the house. Vexus. Yo. Giant, uh... Giant horse. Okay? Peeve, I was watching you do something so ridiculous. You were trying to fish minecarts out of some lake the other day. And I couldn't what? stop watching. It was ridiculous. It was insane. See, here's how you, here's how you catch a horse. You fly in from a... Look, see, it's already aware. It's looking around. It senses. It senses the danger. That's the, that's the, that's the legendary horse right there. Look at those miniature horses, and there's giant horse right there. We're gonna fly in, fly in, catch him off guard. Yes, it is time. This was literally the first horse I tried to tame and got bucked off. I got bucked off. <laughs> So fast and so we spent such a long time trying to sneak up on it and chasing after it little did we know we had no idea We had no idea But now we're back much wiser and with much better stats Hello friend <laughs> We're back <laughs> No freaking way. Are you kidding me? <laughs> uh, playing hard to get, huh? <laughs> playing hard to get, are we? Well, 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 well. I enjoy a challenge. We're losing stamina right now. about a little bit of stamina regen that I don't have. God damn it. <laughs> no! <gasps> My god. We're not good enough. We're not good enough. Oh my god. I can't believe it. We need eat. Uh, I wonder if I can. Uh, maybe if I eat some. I need to make some food. Okay. We need to cook some food. Where can we cook food around here? I cannot believe it. That's one of the first things we did. And I said, listen, we're going to come back. I've almost explored the rest of the map. I've leveled up so much. And this horse is still just kicking my ass like it's nothing. Like it's nothing. <sighs> I don't know exactly how many points we put into stamina, though. Do you guys know? Just looking at my stamina, I can't remember. Not as many heart, not as many compared to the hearts. That's for sure. Bucked off again. I can't believe it. That's all good, Peeve. You're working on your achievements with your artist. Needed to see something. Okay. Cannon breed. I know cannon breed. Cannon breed does some good stuff, Peeve. 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 One day you will be mine. It's just like sometimes, sometimes fellas, you're out there, or even ladies, reverse, you know, or whoever is just trying to attract someone. And they go in, sometimes you take a shot and that shot gets absolutely denied. Sometimes it's time to just say, listen, move on to a different horse, but sometimes you can't give up. You can't give up. And that's why we're gonna go get some food, and then we're gonna come back. I'll be back again. Can't believe that. What's up, Karmar? Five extra. And you can also trade hearts for stamina. You can do that, yeah. There's that, uh... I'm not even sure what the name of it was. It's in... Actually, it's freaking... 
That's a great idea. I don't know why I did that. We want to go over here. And we want to go to... Hateno? Hateno Village. Here we go. Hmm. There are other horses in the sea. <laughs> I've got the Master Sword. Yes, Karmar. Mm hmm. I like the Switch's UI as well, Orbital OBS. I do like it. Uh, there's less going on because it doesn't have Netflix and all those other apps like um, your other gaming consoles, which I don't use. I don't use because I don't really watch apps or Hulu or Netflix or, or Twitch. I watch Twitch on my PCs here sometimes, but this is more of like my full-on gaming setup. Whereas if I'm going to be watching TV, basically Netflix, that's upstairs and I happen to have a smart TV. So I could hook in my Xbox 360 and get some use out of it, but I've already got a smart TV. Which, uh, looking back, kind of didn't really need that. Because I've got an Xbox. But it was on sale. It was on sale. Going the wrong way. We want to go over here. You guys missed it. I bought that house over there. You can buy this house and you can decorate it. I bought it and I decorated it. And, uh... pretty nice. Now there, down there, or somewhere around here, we put some trees out here, we put some flowers out here. Look at this, home sweet home. Look at that. Oh man. We tried to put some fish in here. That was one of the saddest moments. That was, for the Salmon King, that was a very sad moment. Watch, I'll show you guys what happened. We put the frog down, the frog just ran away. We took our fish here, we held it, we said, BE FREE! Okay. Okay. Sadness. Um, here is the house. As you can see, there's lots of places where you can display stuff, but if I display stuff, then I'm not holding on to it, and I'm on a very important mission right now. Yeah, <laughs> bummer, man. <laughs> hey, what's up, Cannon Nabel? What's up? Pyro flamed, I agree about the, the UI. 100%, yeah. It is a Master Sword, by the way, you can do this. Which is pretty cool, if you have full hearts. You need exactly 13 hearts to pull out the Master Sword. As someone so eloquently spoiled in the chat for me a couple streams ago. So eloquent. Where is that little statue? It's over here. So let's see how this works. I don't know. I'm a little hesitant to do this because I feel like this was weird. This was like weird last time. You come to tamper with your ensign your essence. Essence. Yes, please. I'm currently without any of your essences. Are you in the mood to sell? Yes. What type of essence? Heart container. 100 roops? I mean, I've got tons of cash. This just seems like deal with the devil shit. I would prefer to just go out, find some more shrines... I mean, there's still plenty of shrines for me to find. We find more shrines. Fuck this guy. This guy's full of shit, man. I'm out of here. Don't like you. Here's what we're gonna do instead. We're gonna delay this mission. Catch the horse. We're not there yet. We're gonna fly back over here. And then we're gonna go travel into the unknown. It's one of the first areas we tried to go to. And we just were getting dominated. Absolutely dominated. Dominated. So we're gonna we're gonna move on. We're gonna move on. Wow. Ah, righteous soup. Thirteen months for the future. Thank you. And nice moves. Nice buns. Appreciate that continued support. Righteous soup. Righteous did. Totally righteous. 
feels righteous, man. Did I knock this off? I can't remember at this point, so let's go ahead and take a moment. I don't know if I had, uh, I don't know if I had stasis yet. <laughs> Master Sword, no! That should be enough energy, come on. Yaha! You must have already found me! Right, let's do this really quick. Oh. Did I climb? I can't remember. Let's go take, let's take a quick detour just for a second here. And make our way up here. Oh, hello. Hello. There's a sledgehammer there. And then what we could do is we'll go up here. I believe it was, was it too cold for me to go up here before? No, I've been up here. That's where we, oh, it's cold up here. Oh, it's cold. And then I think the smartest thing to do would just be to head to that tower first and foremost. Just kind of fly across there, climb up, and head for that tower. That's going to be the game plan. Uh, I'm not going to make that, so we're going to turn over here. This is a new zone for us. A new place to explore. There's that horse down there. Freaking horse. Go over here, climb up, climb up, and just start walking on in there. I don't know, I, part of me wants to go to that one, and part of me wants to go to the tower first. I feel like I should go to the tower first. Just because. Although we, we haven't really been following that as a guideline. We've sort of been either just going in and randomly exploring, and sometimes we've gone towards a tower. I don't know. Do you guys go right for the towers? The Great Plateau. I wonder if it's gonna be really hot up here. Hot. Milk was a bad choice. <laughs> I think milk is a good choice, even when it's hot outside. I don't care. I like milk. Chocolate milk? It's a funny joke, though. What the hell is that noise? Whoa! Whoa! One more. Yaha! You just go wherever the road takes you, huh? That's a good way to be, Orbital OBS. You finished off Ganon after work, Mr. Bladder. Need to finish getting everything else now. Are you gonna go 100%, Mr. B? We were talking about this last night. I'm not, you guys know this, I'm not a 100%er. I'm not gonna find all the Korok seeds. How many are there? Like hundreds? Let's check the temperature. Temperature's okay right here, actually. Yeah, we'll make our way towards that tower first. This is all unexplored. This is a whole new world. Oh, shush. Oh, come on. Bummer, man. Boom. What? Balto! There's 900 something. What the heck? 900 Korok seeds. Oh, come on. 100%. If there was like some. I almost feel like they should really give you something Gale is now special ready. for 100% in games. I, I, I don't know. What do you get? Like a little achievement or something? I feel like just games in general should reward those people, but it seems like enough people just like doing it just to do it. People just like 100%ing things. In the chat, are you a completionist 100%er or 
Are you just do the story, then move on? I just feel like some games, it would turn into more of a hassle for me. In this game in particular, I see... Um, I see myself finding all the shrines and finding all of the memories. But not the Korok seeds. The Korok seeds, that sounds like a that sounds like a nightmare. Boo -doo -doo. You get poop. <laughs> Golden poop. Okay. You get Zelda's buns. There we go. Sounds like you guys have all, yeah. <laughs> Wow, okay, it's only in games you truly enjoy, and it depends on the game. Well, what games have you 100%ed then? What, what are some examples? Because I'm trying to think of games that I completed 100%, and I'm saying like 100% collectibles and everything, and I don't, I don't know. I, I can't think of one at all right now. I'm just more, I do the story. If it adds to the story, I like to do it. Sometimes in games, they have stuff that's a little bit... There's the tower up there. Hmm. That's the best way to get up there. Rivali's Gale. Okay. Oh, okay. Let's just bail. Let's just bail out. Here we go. How conveniently located. Are you freaking kidding me? Okay, Link. Be very careful, Link. Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh! I knew it! Why? Why is that built like that? Who would build that like that? That makes no sense. Stupid. I'm not a carpenter. I don't build wall ledges. No, and I'm getting attacked. Oh my god, I did it. Who did that? Where are you? Oh, you dirtbag. What the shit? Yeah. Ah! Ah! No! The temperature's getting high. Oh my god, everything is going wrong. This is fine. It's fine. Or just climb up. Just climb up. What the? Ah! No! Shit! Ah! Run away! Oh, my buns. My buns. <laughs> I don't like this. Okay. What the hell? We, who built that? All right, let's, we're going over here. Change of plans. I see something over here. Let's just go check it out. The person's like, huh. The best place for me to stand is right on this unsafe ledge. I bet you this is the, this is the guy that fucking built this up there. At least that's who we're gonna say built this. He built all these, and he's admiring his work right now. Ha! Huh. My name is uh, Sammy. Sammy, the unsafe bridge builder guy. Hey, Sammy! <laughs> ah, how very fitting, Sam. Samuel. <laughs> he's fine, right, guys? <laughs> no. <laughs> uh. Uh, let me see. Soulsborn series has platinums as well as some of What do you do to 100% a Soulsborn game? Exactly, Pearly. The Arkham games. I still have never played those. Uh, Pearly's gonna freak out when he hears me say that. Cause he's been waiting for it. But we haven't had a gap in the schedule. You know that, Pearly. We've been waiting for a time when I can get through those Arkham games. At least three out of the four of them. There's one that's like not as good. Kingdom Hearts, Red, Hit, Red Dead Redemption, 100%. Okay. Yeah, Grand Theft Auto always has, like, uh, or at least Rockstar games seem to usually have some some uh, collectibles that you can run around and find and collect. Ba -da -da -da. Linda Belcher, go get his loot all the way down there. No. Oh, wait, was there a chest back there? There's a chest or something. That's okay. I'm pretty, I'm feeling pretty good in terms of my loot. My loot. Give me the loot. Give me the loot. Give me the loot. Give me the loot. 
This should be fine. Okay. Oh, we're getting so close to the tower. If we get a horse in here, this will kind of be like Red Dead Redemption. We should play that song that's in Red Dead Redemption. The first time we go to Mexico. This is Mexico. Mexico. I usually get every important weapon and see every ending. The Souls games have dumb ones. Like, get the best weapon, though, in every upgrade path. But it's not bad. Some of the trophies were awful, though. And you did it? See, that's what I'm talking about! How is that fun? You're saying it's awful! <laughs> You're saying it's awful. Did it even give you anything for doing that? If it, like, gave you something really sweet, I'd be like, yeah. Cool. The Master Sword is back. But, like, what games give you something? But I, I don't know. Maybe it's... Maybe it's just... I'm wired differently. And those people who are completionists... They just get that satisfaction. They just get that satisfaction. Alright, we, sh we should be fine here. Just right on up there. Darth Mugius, you heading out? Good night. Yeah, we got a late start in today. Late start? Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just going, just running up, just running up, working them buns, working them buns, work them buns. Look at that. Look at that. He's gonna have to climb right here. There he is. Still impressive. Oh yeah. Oh, you want a piece of this? Okay. We had to take out the archer first. Even though this guy's probably gonna Oh, never mind, he's down there. Is his arm gonna fly down there and reconnect? It's crawling back towards him. We'll leave him be for now. This is some sort of toxic sludge. Toxic sludge. Ugh, gross. Wow, since we use this power, to be honest. The Wasteland. This is called The Wasteland, huh? Kobe and, uh, says, Mr. Future Man, how'd you like Strafe? Yes. Strafe was awesome. It was fun. It was intense. It was fast-paced. Um, I, I thoroughly enjoyed it. And I believe it's out today. How many Guardians have you completed? I've completed three out of four. The only one I haven't completed is the one in this- Oh! No! <laughs> what the hell? Where was that wind coming from? Out of nowhere? I- I can't believe that. That's ridiculous. That- Okay, I'm gonna get a little bit closer this time before making any type of jump. That's a joke! Look at this! There we go. Come on. Oh shit. There's no way I can make that. Uh, maybe I can. I'll try this. We'll see if we can make it. Sludge. Sludge. Demon Soul is the only one that you had an awful trophy. It required you to get an item that has a 0.001% chance. Ugh. That sounds terrible, Pearly. <laughs> nah, Brad, I'm definitely gonna play Red Dead Redemption 2. Yes. Scuba, that sounds pretty dope. Gives you something pretty tangible, pretty cool for... Horizon's still on my list of games to check out. Everybody keeps saying it's so good. Too many good games this year. Too many good games this year. Too many good TV shows. It's the best time. It's the best time to be a nerd right now. Are comic books on point right now? Can anyone who reads comics, like, it's just TVs, movies, they're knocking it out of the park. Also, that new Blade Runner trailer, I couldn't help it. I was too interested in checking it out. I'm t I'm t it looks like they're hitting the aesthetic. Oh, is it cold up here? Oh, it's cold up here. That new Blade Runner trailer. What's up, Blue Pyro? The 
This might be the last tower. Maybe. There, there, well, there might be one more. It's either the last one or the second last one. We're going to find out right now. Scanning area. <laughs> Comics are not too great right now. Oh, uh, man. Okay, yeah, so it is in every single area. Regional map extracted. Wow, it really goes... It really goes out there. Holy moly. Look at that. Red Dead, I think, is way off. Yeah. DC Comics are solid right now? Okay. Okay. Yeah, Blade Runner with Ryan Gosling. I think it's called Blade Runner 20... Uh, what's it called? Blade Runner... 20... 2049. There it is. It looks sweet. Yeah, the trailer, uh, I think they just released a new trailer today. Um, if Pearly or one of the subs wants to drop it in the chat, feel free so other people can check it out. Again, I don't, I don't feel like the trailer gave away the whole plot of the movie. So, in terms of my rating on the trailer, it was a good trailer. Because it didn't give away anything from the story, but it showed visually what it kind of looked like. It was a nice trailer. It was good. All right, now we need to decide. Right, let's first off, let's just look around. Let's just freaking look around. So this is, it's kind of like the area out there is is what we've known and seen. Amazing wow. views, by the way. Ay 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 wah! Amazing views. Karma, three months. Let's keep the Nerf Squad hype alive. Thank you, Karma. Potato moves, nice moves. For the future. Thank you, my dude. Activating that new badge. Looking so good. How many hearts do we need? Five and a half. Rivali's Gale is now Rivali's Gale. Let's eat one apple. Oh, what's something that's going to give me a half? This, right? Let's eat pepper. Because then I can go. Use that power, which is pretty cool. So that is all, and then it looks like it gets a little bit cold up there. I feel like, hmm, in terms of exploration, maybe we should just go straight down here, explore all along this, and then kind of slither back up, and then go out into the Gerudo Desert. We're going to need to find a stable out there, so we'll keep our eyes peeled for a stable, because I feel like this will be a great place to have a horse, but it looks like there's some interesting things out here. West Gurio Ruins, the dunes, Palu Wasteland, bones, the desert. Look at this. I don't even know what that is. Cool. So we're looking the direction that we want to go, which is basically... Yeah. Whoa, what the sh... Whoa! It's a giant. <laughs> it's a camel. It's a robot camel. <laughs> right? I think. What the heck is that face, though? <laughs> camel. Camel. The new Aliens film, uh, I'm excited for the new Alien, Aliens film. Alien Resurrection, it looks kind of very similar to Prometheus in the way that Prometheus was like, go to a new planet, then there's aliens and crazy shit there, and then you fight the aliens and then you get out of there. So I don't know how they're going to make this different, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> Later, Hunter Cash. Have a good one, Hunter Cash. Hunter Cash. But yeah, Prometheus and... Whoa! That wind is just gusting. Potentially some items in all those boxes, but I'm not that interested. Let's go over here and just get a Korok seed. The wind is just freaking all over the place out here. 
Dry Weenus dropping those nice buns in the chat. What's up, Dry Weenus? Hope everything is going good. Going good. So dry. How, how convenient that you're here, right? When we are in this arid desert area. It's almost like you knew. Your presence was requested and needed. Jam it in there. Jam it in there. Maybe that's not where it goes. Hold on. Slow down, future man. Slow the frick down. That's not where it goes at all. One, two, 